Hey YouTube, Bill here. Uh, just wanted to show you guys this little kit that I made. Um, we're gonna put it together. I'm gonna show you how it goes together. Before we do though, I wanna show you with the wood, there's gonna be some different fitments uh, when, it, when I go to put the pieces in the slots. Um, this is due to inconsistencies in the wood. Uh, sometimes it's a little thicker in some spots and a little bit thinner in some spots. spots. Try to show you here. So this one's coming in right at about 118 thousandths over here. Uh, take another piece. This one's at like 122, 123, somewhere in there. So because of these inconsistencies, um, it's gonna affect the fitment of it. So, all right, we got two side plates here. This is the middle uh, back support. You'll see where that goes in a little bit. We got our three shelves for the oils. Um, this is the top part of the shelf. We have two bottom support shelves with slots in them. Uh, you'll see why. And then we have an, another uh, bottom support shelf. This is a back plate to help keep it sturdy. And then this is the front face plate. Um, and the reason for this is, you know, added sturdiness, but also you can, you know, put, if you have a machine to do it, um, you can put an engraving here, you know, like uh, Tina's oils or, you know, something like that, whatever you want to do. Um, and then of course you can paint it. I'll, although I do recommend to not paint until after you put it together or if you paint it before you put it together, tape off these edges here because if you don't, you're adding to the overall thickness and then you might have some fitment issues when you go to put it together. Um, so that goes for any kind of finish. All right, so I'm gonna show you kind of how I do it. Um, so the top, is you know the top slot is for the oils slots or holes and you see that's kind of tight and my goal when making this was to try to get it to a point where it fits together nice and snug that way you don't have to use any glue um, but you can add glue if you want to all right so now i'm going to do these two bottom shelves with the slots in them one's going to go here Okay, and the other one goes up here. And then this last, and these, the back plate and other bottom support shelf, they're the same exact pieces, so it doesn't matter which one, you just pick one and, you know, stick them in. This one's gonna be a little bit of a tight fit, but there we go. This one here, and then your front face plate goes here. Now, the fun, tricky part is getting this other side plate on. So it should only go on one way. And this is where it gets a little interesting. So I try to line up a few of these as best as I can. Okay, and I start, you hear that squeaking noise, that's because it's kind of a tight fit, um, but that's good, you know, that means it'll be together nice and tight. And I'm tapping on it um, to make sure it goes on there. You see I'm not doing it real hard, okay? Just a light tap. And there we go. once you get it in there all the way, you'll know because it'll be flush with the side plate, okay? Now, last piece is this one here. It only goes in one way, so it shouldn't, shouldn't be able to mess that up. And you can see that these little notches here are gonna go into these slots. So just line it up, and there we go. The reason for this is um, my first original design, whenever you put it together and you put the oils in these bottom shelves here would sag. Um, so I, my beautiful wife had the wonderful idea of making another little step ladder to put in for a support and it works great. So there it is. Um, you can find the link to the digital file to make, you know, cut it out and make it yourself if you have the machinery to do so. Uh, my Etsy store, I'll put the link in the description down below. Uh, and if you want to order the actual physical product, you can do that as well. I'll have the link for that 
in the description below as well. Um, whenever we send it to you, it will be completely disassembled. That's why I'm making this video so you can see how it goes together should you decide to go ahead and order one. Thanks for watching.